Welcome back to House Clark. We are making salmon croquettes. Everything that you'll need for this recipe will be in the description box down below. First, dice half an onion. We're going to use two cans of salmon and we need to remove the skin and the bones. Gently rub off any of the skin that you see. Try to remove as much as possible. You will find bones as you peel away the sections, so just try to be as thorough as possible. Once the salmon's clean, we're ready to season. We'll be using salt, paprika, garlic powder, black pepper, and about a teaspoon of celery seed. Once your seasonings are in, Gently toss the salmon, break up any large pieces that you find. Try not to mash it into a paste. Just continue to gently toss until all of your seasonings have been incorporated. We'll be using two eggs as our binding agent and we'll just need to whisk those and add them into our salmon. Now add the half of onion that we diced up. Again, just toss all of the ingredients around, make sure everything is well incorporated, and we're gonna get ready to fry. Now we're gonna patty up a few of these croquettes. Just grab enough of the salmon that you can cup in the palm of your hands. And we're gonna form this into kind of an oblong circle. Once you have it in the desired shape, just kind of compress the patty down a little bit and that'll help it bind together a lot more. We have our pan a quarter full with oil and we did prep our pan with the little fat back and that is optional. Have your pan set to a medium high heat. You'll need a spoon to put the croquettes into the oil. So just place a croquette on the spoon and then put it over into the oil. Once you see that your croquettes have browned, you can go ahead and gently turn them over. Depending on the heat, this side will need three to five minutes. Once your croquettes are brown on both sides, remove them with a pair of tongs, allow them to drain for at least three minutes, and then they're ready to serve. We hope you enjoy this recipe for salmon croquettes. Thank you again for stopping by House Clark. Please be sure to like this video and subscribe to our daily cooking vlog.